So I'll be showing you how to move photos and videos from your iPhone directly to an external hard drive or external SSD. Now for this specific tutorial, I'm going to be using this SSD, but of course it's the same exact tutorial or instructions for the traditional hard drive. So since I have an SSD and most SSDs come with a Type-C connector and I have an iPhone 16 with a Type-C port, all I have to do is simply connect. Now, if you have an older iPhone with Lightning or an older uh, hard drive, then you might need to get the correct adapters that will suit your connection. So for instance, I have the full-size Type-A to Type-C. You can use that if you have an older hard drive and an iPhone 16. I have this one, which is Type-C female to full-size USB. And I also have this adapter, which will connect uh, USB devices to a Lightning iPhone. Okay, so depending on your situation, just get the correct adapter. I'll leave uh, an article link below showing you all the adapters you can use for this particular tutorial. Anyway, first things first, connect your iPhone and your external hard drive or SSD. So there you go. I have mine connected. This particular one does require a fingerprint. So I'm just going to scan so it can open up. Now, once you open it up or once you connect, the first thing you need to do is go to the files app and ensure that the connection has been established. So just go and open up this app, the files app on your iPhone. And if you go and tap on browse and go to the home page of the files app, you should see your hard drive or SSD. So here's mine. I'm just going to tap on it to open it and you can see the files and folders inside my hard drive. So now the easiest way to do this is to create a folder just to keep things neat. So you can create a folder in here by long pressing an empty space and then selecting new folder. And I'm going to call this uh, folder uh, wedding. Wedding photos. Okay, and then tap on done. And here's my folder as you can see. So now once I create that folder, the next thing you want to do now is exit out of the files app. And then now you can go into the photos app because that's where your photos and videos are. So open up the photos app. And then from here, you can select all the photos and videos you want to transfer. All right. So just tap on the select button and then select everything you want to transfer. It could be photos, videos, doesn't really matter. Select everything you need to transfer like that. And then once you select everything you want, tap on the share button in the bottom left corner and, and then go to save to files. So from that menu that pops up, tap on save to files like that. That's going to open up the files up on your iPhone. So in the files up, make sure you go to the home. Just tap on back, back until you go and make sure you're on the home page. Now on the home page, you can ignore this recently used uh, section. Just come and select your hard drive. I'm going to select mine. Just tap on it once and then look for the folder you created. Here's mine, wedding photos. I'll tap on it to open it. And then now I can tap on save in the top right corner. And as you can see, all the photos and videos I selected are now being copied into the hard drive. So once I uh, do that, I can now go to the hard drive using the files up and uh, assess the situation. Just open up the wedding photos folder or the folder you created. And then as you can see, all my photos and videos have been copied successfully to the hard drive. So now all I need to do now is exit from here and I can now disconnect my hard drive, take it to my computer or wherever it is I'm taking it. Or if it's for backup, I can just now keep the hard drive. That is how to transfer photos and videos directly from your iPhone to your external SSD or hard drive. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you found this video useful. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down in the comment section and I will talk to you in the next one. Good luck.